Hello and welcome to an unboxing edition of the SGR Corner of Randomness. Yes, I was off to Texas for a couple days, and when I came home, I came home to find my Marvel Collector Core had arrived, and as you can see, it is Deadpool themed because, you know, Deadpool has recently come out, which I keep hearing pretty good things about. So, uh, Carrie already kind of showed you one item that was in here, but I have no idea what the other stuff is. So, let's go ahead and uh, just tear into this. It is a nice spot. I do like the uh, scratchy kind of look on the, on the cover art there. All right, so first thing, it's not really as full of uh, the comics that I'm used to. Usually the comic stuff all runs on like the flaps and there's a lot more. The, the comic stuff is actually a lot smaller, so that's a nice little change. So as always, we have a nice little uh, uh, badge here. You need to start really finding places to put that. And like always, a nice little Deadpool pin. So that's pretty fun. Love me some pins. And because this is a Funko type product, if you hadn't really noticed, uh, Funko is putting out quite a lot of stuff lately. But we always get a shirt, and that's pretty awesome. Here, let's just get this box kind of like tilted over there. But the shirt is actually really fun. Uh, I do like that. It's a nice little fun, fun shirt. Good thing I'm doing laundry today. And we also have a nice comic with Deadpool on his chimichangas. Never actually read any of the comics that come with these because I always like to just sleeve them immediately because, you know, when you got stuff like Marvel Collector Core at the top, it does add a little bit of value and you have a nice little, uh, Number one variant cover there, so that's fun. Put that over there. All right, and let's see what else we got. Oh, we have a nice little Deadpool plushie. Starting to need more space for all the plushies. And we also have a Deadpool Dorbs. I know some people love these, and I know some people hate them. I find them adorably cute. So, I do very much enjoy them. Let's go ahead and pull Deadpool out. Oh, he wasn't even really stuck in there. But look at him. He's so adorable. Or Dorbs. Look, he's even got a little uh, riding pony, riding horse stick thing that we all had as children. At least I did. But, very nicely done. Very nice paint job. You got his swords on the back. Nice little belt. Kind of giving you the wink. Nice little cowboy hat. How cute is that? How cute is that? And then we also have the Deadpool actual Funko thing. So if I remember right, yep, this is a bobblehead. So let's go ahead and get in here. Aw, oh, and he's like flying. You know, for being a sarcastic, terrible, mean kind of uh, character, they sure did make him all kinds of cute. But, so, little, little wobblies. But he's on a little stand, kind of like he's flying through the air with the sword out, getting ready to chop people. I do like that the sword isn't really bent in any sort of way. But yeah, that's a ton of fun. So, overall this was a lot of fun. I really love the Dorbs thing. That'll probably, I might have to change some of the toys on my desk just to keep Deadpool up there. Uh, yeah, the shirt was great too. I do love their shirts. So. With that, we've now unboxed the Deadpool edition of the Marvel Collector Core. Another solid box. I, you know, it only comes out once every two months, and uh, it's like 25 bucks for this. And it's still one of the best box subscription services that I've had outside of the arcade block. Um, so if you're looking into this, now's the time to dive in. I heard that next month is going to be Civil War. You know, either your Team Iron Man or your Team Captain America. I'm a team whoever wins, so I'm really looking forward to that movie too. Haven't seen Deadpool yet, but I have heard really good things about it. But with that, I hope you enjoyed. And remember, don't be a dick on the internet. With that, I'm out. Peace.